Welcome to another tutorial by Shadow Dragon. Today I'm going to show you how to get factorization energy. It's a fairly involved process, but it's well worth it for the 300% ore yield that you can get using the ore processing and factorization that needs this energy. So, uh, to get started, I'm going to show you everything you need. Uh, you're going to need a slag furnace, which you just make with cobblestone on the sides and two furnaces. Okay, in the slag furnace, when you cook silver ore in it, it will give you both lead and silver. Okay, you're also going to need sulfuric acid, which is made with gunpowder, coal, and a water bottle. Okay, and then you're going to need a full battery. Okay, to make the battery, you just put lead, iron, and your sulfuric acid together. Okay, and you'll need to use some of that lead also to make lead wire. Okay, and to, you'll use the battery with the lead wire to make the magnet. All right, just like this. And the battery goes in the bottom. This will use up some charge in the battery block, but you will keep it. And you'll get a magnet out of that. You'll keep the wires as well. Okay. So uh, once you have that, you're also going to want to make some insulated coil, which is just a clay block with a bunch of lead around it. You're going to need four of these. Okay. And with all of that, you'll be able to make a motor. All right. And the motor is like so with the insulated coil battery in the center or I'm sorry magnet in the center with uh, the ingots here alright and then a fan which is very easy to make and you'll also need a bunch of mirrors uh, mirrors are just a lot of silver with glass panes in the center so you're gonna want uh, two water buckets as well to do this so all you have to do is make an infinite water source all right, and once you have that, place your water, like so, to make your infinite water source. And then you want something to place against here. You place your solar turbine, and this is what's going to give us our energy, okay? Now, to get energy from this, all you have to do is place your mirrors around like so, and you'll see that they will automatically point at the turbine, okay? And the turbine starts spinning, and that basically means you're getting power. So all you have to do now is run a lead wire from this to wherever you want your machines, okay? And we'll hook a heater up to this so that you can see it's working. Nice and simple. That's how you get factorization energy. If you like this tutorial, please click like and thanks for watching.